Here's problem number 37 from section 3.1. Um, it asks, if the left-hand derivative and the right-hand right derivative exists, um, does it show, does that mean that the uh, derivative exists at that particular point? Now, I'm kind of cheating because I have the answer listed here, but let me see if I can give a, a really thorough explanation. Let's take the example of the absolute value function. Now, the absolute value function, all of the derivatives along here are negative 1. And as I approach the origin, coming this direction, taking secant line, secant line, secant line, based on those points, all of my slopes are negative 1. So from the left-hand side, the left-hand derivative exists and it's negative 1. Now, on the right-hand side, if I take the origin and any of these second points, as I get closer and closer, all of those functions, all of those uh, um, estimates to the derivative equals 1. So as I get closer and closer to 0, they're all 1. Now, this left-hand derivative exists, this right-hand derivative exists, but they don't equal each other. And because left-hand derivative does not equal the right-hand derivative, our conclusion is that the derivative at 0 does not exist.